At Saqqara, archaeologists get ready to open the coffin of an ancient Egyptian woman. Oh, oh wow, 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 wow. Very nice. Very, very nice. The team is finally face to face with a woman who lived two and a half millennia ago. Muhammad thinks there is something unusual about the woman's body. The mummy has a mysterious looking bump. So maybe this woman, when she died, she was pregnant. Excavation director Dr. Mustafa Waziri will use an X-ray machine to try to find out one way or the other. If this woman was pregnant, the X-rays could show an unborn baby. Instead, they reveal her hands. This young woman was not pregnant. The bump is formed by her hands, lying twisted across her stomach. It's an unusual pose. Normally, a mummy's hands were arranged by the sides or across the chest. But this woman's hands appear to be unnaturally contorted. The question that I did ask, was she disabled in the hands? They take more x-rays to search for other physical deformities. What's the backbone? The backbone fee, 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 a little bit, a little bit move, huh? We have seen the backbone. It's not straight. This condition looks like a sideways curvature of the spine, known as scoliosis. Severe scoliosis can reduce the amount of space in the chest and impair the lungs. So this young woman may have had real difficulty breathing. X-rays reveal even more health problems. Look at this one, which is very important. We can see that there is one shorter than the other. Look so, I can see something here. It seems that the small broken part of the patella of the bone. Uneven legs, damaged knees, and a curved spine could be the result of a serious and painful illness like polio. The x-rays reveal that this wealthy young woman had several incurable health problems that may have been terminal. The team now has a clearer picture of how she died. So, what was her life like? At the time, physical ailments could mean a painful existence, but not one lived in the shadows. The Egyptians often represented conditions such as blindness or deformities in their artwork. From the famous boy pharaoh Tutankhamun, who had a limp, to high-ranking officials like Seneb, who lived around 2500 BC and was a person with dwarfism. The painted mummy's beautiful coffin and immaculate preservation indicates that this woman was well-loved by her family. The nuclear family was very, very important to members of the Egyptian elite. So they would be united in life and united forever after in the great beyond. <laughs>